So it's a real team effort because while we're standing here putting all these things together for the boxes, Annie's been at home making us a nice poster to advertise our boxes. So a big team effort and the amount of love that's going into these boxes. What I'm doing is making some chocolate from scratch here. Um, I've got my cocoa butter and, uh, and sweetener. I'm using uh, agave and some vanilla. I'm going to mix it all together with the, uh, the cocoa butter, cocoa powder and make my own chocolate to come out like that. So it's this whole step process. What I'm in the process of doing here is creating, uh, mixing my own chocolate. And so what I do is I take um, take a liquid sweetener, agave nectar, and it took me for a long while in New York trying to figure out how to temper chocolate because so making chocolate is not as simple as just putting it together and pouring it into a mold. You've got to temper it, which is, you know heating it up to a certain temperature, and then you've got to lower it to a certain temperature, and that's what gives it that shine. And um, it's been a long while since I've done it, like a couple of years. But what we're doing here is um, I got some my sweetener, the agave nectar. I got some vanilla in there. And I'm using this, I'm trying to, have, this first time I use this, but this uh, Jerusalem Archeloke Choke Powder. It's an inulin, it's actually got really, it's good for the, uh, the good bacteria in the gut too, but it uh, has a little bit of a sweetness and hopefully it'll add a little bit of creaminess to the chocolate. And then over here, I'm coming! I've got the cocoa butter in there, like, and if you smell that, it smells like chocolate. We've separated the fat and the, the you know, the powder um, in the chocolate and what I'm going to do is now mix it back together again adding my own sweetener. So what I have here is the, the fat from the chocolate, the cocoa butter and I, so we have separated the, the cocoa powder and the cocoa butter and now I'm going to mix it back together but I'm adding my own sweetener and the vanilla powder and that way then we can get a healthier, much much healthier chocolate and we're using all organic fair trade, this is even raw and I'm going to mix it together, I'm going to temper it, that means I've got to heat it up to a certain temperature, I'm going to put it on this stainless steel, lower it to a certain temperature really quickly, and I'm going to pour it into the mold. And hopefully that will set. Um, it, because it's got liquid seed, it's not going to go really, really hard, but it's going to have like more of a creaminess to it. So who knows, that's what I'm trying to do.